everybody. Today we will learn about the digestive system in humans. So, let's start. Here is the mouth and we take food. The, when we chew it with the teeth, so it's gone into the simpler substances and the tongue provides the saliva with the, with the help of salivary glands. Okay? So, and it becomes very juicy. Then, it goes to the esophagus, the food pipe. So, esophagus means the food pipe. Esophagus passes the food to the stomach. So, the stomach contains the hydrochloric acid. Okay. So, let's start here. The stomach contains enzymes. The stomach contains the enzymes known as the pepsino, pepsinogen. So, it is an inactive enzyme. So, in the presence of hydrochloric acid means the HCl, it converts it into the pepsin. And the pepsinogen, the atmosphere is favorable of the acidic atmosphere. So, now it converts into the pepsin and it is an active enzyme. So, it is an active enzyme and now starts the digestion. Then, the food is here and the food, the proteins are digested in the stomach and the carbohydrates are digested in the mouth. I will tell you a very interesting thing about the stomach. The pepsin and the acid is very much strong that it can digest the stomach itself. Do you know it? Then, to protect the stomach, there is a thin layer known as the mucus. It is mucus. Yes. Then, the, then the fats digest in the gallbladder. And gallbladder and the pancreas provide the bile juice and the pancreatic juice which helps to digest the food easily. Then here this part is known as the duodenum. It's known as the duodenum which is the widest layer in the all layers. Okay, I will tell you about two more layers. So here is duodenum. And after this duodenum, the food passes to the small intestine. And the small intestine contains the small layers known as willies. And willies absorb the digested food and willies contain the blood vessels which transfer the food to the whole body parts and it gives the nutrients. Then the food transfers to the large intestine. The undigested food. So, it goes to the large intestine and the water is absorbed here. Then, it, the undigested food comes out with the help of the anus. Now, did you understand the digestive systems? If you understand, so like my video. Thank you.